Thanks for joining us on the John Mandola Show. We are driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Centers. Let's talk Valley View Cougars football. Ethan Carey joining us right now. Well, Ethan, uh, welcome into the show. And, uh, hey, we're here. Another football season, double sessions underway. Uh, not much could be better. I'm sure you're really excited to be a Cougar. Oh, absolutely, man. There's, there's really nothing like being a Cougar. There's, uh, there's, there's so much pride down there, and there's such a sense of family. It, it's really – you can't really get it at any other place. And Coach Awanitz, uh he bleeds it as well, going through the program himself. Uh, uh, talk what it's like to, to grow up knowing uh, that your your coaches care so much about what it's like to, to be a Cougar as well. Um, it's it's a really good feeling, you know, because they've gone through it all. They've gone through all the practices, the doubles. They know what it takes to be a Cougar. I mean, my coach, George Wannitz, he was a part of the 1992 state championship team, and that's something I don't think anybody around here has even come close to to do and so it's 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 really good to know that uh the coaches are behind us and they 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 um they have that good sense of pride with us ethan uh athlete is the position coach puts you at at offense does that mean you can line up anywhere um yeah i feel like i could line up in most spots um line up at receiver you know run some routes and i can line up in the backfield and play tailback that's that's where i've been working a lot this summer in the backfield with uh Scott was so jack graduating, so I've been really spending a lot of time in the backfield, but I feel just as comfortable as lining up in the in the slot or all that wide receiver. Ethan, what are some tools that you have on the football field you think that could, you know, separate you a little bit from some of the other players? Is it your feet, your speed, your hands, your vision? What are or a couple things you take some pride in and say, yeah, I'm pretty good at that. I still gotta work on that a little bit more. Um, I think I have good speed, you know, I I I run track, I was part of the uh second placing uh relay team the at districts this year um i also feel my football iq is pretty good you know i feel like i understand the game pretty well it get puts me in spots where you know i'm able to make plays i'm able to help the team out you know and i'm sure you get to do it with uh your brother and usually when you talk to guys that are twins they always say hey he's my best friend i don't want to just you know kind of assume he is but uh tell us about your relationship with your brother evan Oh uh, yeah, me, me and Evan have a real good relationship. You no, know, we, I mean, we've been playing football since we were five years old. Um, it's it's great playing out there with your twin brother, you know. Um, but it gets really competitive, you know, because uh, we're always competing to be the best athlete in the household. You know, he'll be like, oh well, you know, I scored, and I mean, no, I'm trying to match him. It's always competitive, but we know in the end it'll make us better. What are, and that'll help the team out. What are some things that maybe the coaches are saying or kids on the team are saying or people in the community when they say, ah, here come the carries? What are, what are, what are some things maybe that hey, you get a chuckle out of when they talk about you and Evan? Um, you know, I, I like you said, I always get a chuckle. Um, they're always saying, you know, I mean, I feel like we're, we're respectable kids, you know. We, um, we're always working hard. They're always saying that. We always work hard in the weight room, out on the field. We're always giving it our all. Well, that's always good to hear that uh, you guys are doing a good job there for Valley View, and, and that leadership is probably part of it this year as a senior. And, and who brings that out more, you or Evan, or kind of both of you try to get after it? Um, both of us try to get after it. I feel like we're, we're, you know, we're different kinds of leaders. I feel like he could be more of a vocal leader sometimes, and sometimes I'm more of a you know, lead-by-example type deal, doing things, you know, trying to do things perfect. Ethan Carey here from the Valley View Cougars on the John Mandola Show. We're driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Centers. Now, the recruiting process, uh, talk a little bit about some schools that you're looking at. And are you in the mix, like your brother, like same school, same interests? Is it different interests? Uh, I remember in the past six months, interested uh, interviewed the two guys from Tunkhannock, wrestlers. They were twins, but uh, they both had different paths that they wanted to go. Uh, how about you and your brother? Um, yeah, we, I think we have pretty, pretty different paths, you know. Um, I mean, I've heard from, both of us have heard from a couple of schools. We've talked to, you know, some coaches have gone, come through, you know, visited us. But, um, for the most part, I feel like we, we kind of, we're kind of different when it comes to that kind of stuff, you know. Um, maybe what we want to, what we want to do after we get out of high school, you know. We're, we're, we're pretty different when it comes to that kind of stuff. So is there a major right now that, that you actually have an interest in or a type of school that you're looking at that you know your brother's thinking a little differently? Um, well, major-wise, I'm thinking looking uh, for something in the sciences. I'm not completely sure yet, 
you know, I feel like that's one of my, my best subjects in school. You know, I, I do really well on that. And I'm not really sure about Evan yet. Um, Evan hasn't Evan hasn't really decided either. He he's kind of he's kind of always uh, changing his mind about that. He's always finding new interests and stuff like that. So. And of course, uh, you're going to have a guy like Jake Osborne uh, back with you guys. Uh, he'll be a pretty good athlete, and Brian Hudak. So uh, there's there's some other guys that are are going to build on. And uh, Angelo Mazzoni's pretty physical and fast off the ball as well. So there's there's guys that are around you that you expect to be a pretty good team. Talk about the the competition this year, and of course, it all starts in week one. Um, it, the competition will be great this year. It'll all start in practice. You know, when we have guys like like when I'm competing against guys like Jake and Evan in practice. We're all pretty much on the same level as athletes, so it's it's always great to be competing against what I think are some of the best athletes in the league. And the same goes for the offensive and defensive line. Um, they're they're always going at it in practice. They're they get all fired up and they like they like going at each other, and that's only going to make us better. And that that'll only make us better when it comes week one when we play Lakeland. Ethan Carey here on the John and Dola Shoulder Show, the show for show from. How about your family and the support you get, whether you said in the classroom or on the field? Uh, uh, I'm sure they're they're rooting you on all the time. Oh, the support is great. Uh, Start to my parents. My parents, have, they've basically done everything for me and Evan since since like I said, we were five. You know, my dad coached us when we were little. He's always been around. You know, helping us out when we're on the field because he played on some pretty good value teams back in the '80s. So he knows he knows what it's like to go through the grind too. Um, my grandparents are great. My aunts and uncles, are, they're at almost every home game. There's so much support. They're always asking me, oh, how's football going? Um, how are you doing? How are you guys looking this year? You know, you guys did a great job. Whether win or lose, they're always behind us. And uh, uh, Eth- Sorry about that. Hold on. <clears throat> Ethan, life goes by so fast. Can you believe it's your senior year right now? Uh, I honestly can't. I remember walking through the doors of the high school as a freshman thinking, wow, I can't believe I'm you know, freshman year, you know, I got three more years, three, four more years of high school, you know, and it's senior year already, 10 more games left, 10 more guaranteed games left, and, you know, hopefully we can make a run in the district playoffs to give give me more opportunity to play this game because it's, it's, there's nothing better than it. No, it's a great feeling, uh, high school days, the glory days, and uh, you're living it right now in this senior season. Well, uh, Ethan, we wish you the very best this season uh, in track and field uh, as well and keep that speed going. And then, of course, in your future endeavors, looks like you have a real nice future ahead for you. Thank you. You got it, man. Ethan Carey will line up with his brother Evan Carey there for the Valley View Cougars. On the John Mandola Show, we are driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Centers.